Today I am taking you along behind the scenes of how I do my product photos for my sticker and stationery boutique. I'm Christine, the creator of Created by Christine, and I'm also every role, every hat worn for my business uh, between the owner, the designer, and the um, the marketer and the photographer that is all me and so with that comes product photography with photography you can go down many avenues of how you want to go about it from very professional investing a lot to um, kind of going DIY economical I found a way that works for me and I do it all in-house with the materials and resources that I already have so let's first talk about materials. Um, let's first talk about materials and tools and resources. So what do I use? Um, I mainly use my iPhone. I currently have an iPhone 14 Pro and that works well because the camera is wonderful. It, I make sure you always use the front camera, sorry, the back camera, not the front camera. And you'll get like the nice quality pictures with the back camera. I think when I started my business, I had an iPhone 7 or 11, a 7. When I first started, I had a 7 and then I quickly upgraded it to 11 because I really couldn't do much with a 7, but it was also really slow. But anyway, so iPhone works. And you can see that I'm putting my iPhone on a tripod um, but this isn't any tripod, it's called a canvas lamp, but I actually don't really use the lamp part. Um, I never actually really have it plugged in. I use it because I like the overhead, like bird's eye view, flat lay angle, because it gets you a really nice view of the product exactly how I want the product presented. But um, there's many tripods out there, a lot of like you've heard of like the gooseneck holder, um, I used to have, I still have that, um, but it's better than kind of like just forward-facing products or just like on an angle. I think sometimes like coming straight on top to see the product is like a really good way for someone who's shopping online to kind of get a sense of how it looks like. So I like to use the canvas lamp with my iPhone. I also like to use like a plain board. What I use actually is like a, it's literally just like a wooden plaque I got from a craft store. And it's because it like, it fills, it's enough if I put it in the middle, a little smudge. Put it in the middle, a product in the middle, and I take a picture of it. And like, it's a nice background because not always do I have like a clean background because my office can get really messy sometimes. And I just like that it's consistent too. I also use like a charcuterie board thing. And then um, I like the contrast between the white wood and also the brown wood. Um, and besides that, like sometimes I use props, but like binder clips but honestly like less is more so now where do I take pictures um I like to do it during the day because I love natural light I think that it really gives it the most authentic kind of view of the product when it's natural light um and you can see here that I actually took it outside because I felt like the sunlight wasn't coming through even though my office has six windows it's technically a sunroom I just felt like it wasn't getting a lot of light so I went outside to do it but I have had to take product photos um, for example like glass products uh, the Sun will like shine and reflect off of it and it gives a weird look so I've used um, I'll put a link or a picture of it but it's like the photo box and that is a quick and easy way to get some like LED lighting and I think I did some pictures with my washi tape with that too so I can put a picture of that as well and it's really affordable um, on Amazon so yeah 